stopping by. Um, we, as a family, the six of us, we are going to try and do Vlogmas this year, which is vlogging or, you know, at least putting up some kind of a video every day in the month of December or at least leading up until Christmas. That is the goal. We are going to try and do that as much as possible. We are going to try and vlog or at least put some kind of a video up every single day until Christmas and then put up a huge Christmas vlog or like a Christmas, the Young Family Christmas special or something like that. It should be fun. But today I'm starting off Vlogmas, December 1st, with a DIY hot cocoa bar. Now, my kitchen is blue, as if you can see, there's a lot of blue going on. My curtains are blue, my wall are like, it's like a teal blue. And that's not typically a Christmas color. So, um, you don't have to use the colors that I use. You can obviously go with whatever your theme is and whatever colors you wanna use. But like I said, my walls are blue, so I have pops of like teal and blue, but I still have the red and the green in there to you know make it a little bit more Christmassy. So if you want to see how I made my hot cocoa bar, stay tuned and I will show you um, piece by piece how I put it all together. And I will try and put links below where I got the things. I Most of it's from the Dollar Tree and a lot of it is stuff I already had from previous Christmases. So um, just stay tuned and I'll show you how I do it. Okay, so here I'm just showing you the cute little Christmas plaque or sign that I got at the Dollar Tree. It has all those beautiful Christmas colors in it, and it even has my kitchen color in it, which brings it all together, which is really awesome. And here is a little jar that um, I got at the Dollar Tree. It's super cute because you can prop it on its side or make it stand up. Um, I like it because it you can just twist the top on. And this little sticker I got from the Target Dollar Spot. So I just put it on top of there. You could even tie a ribbon on it if you wanted to make it a little bit more festive. And I just filled it with marshmallows. And I believe I got the marshmallows from Aldi's. These are those um, cream-filled wafers. They're in the dark chocolate. I got these from the Dollar Tree as well. This is Smucker's Salted Caramel Topping, so good. If you like salted caramel, you have to get this. I got it at Target. These are um, obviously candy canes. <laughs> I just got the mason jar at the Dollar Tree and I just threw them in there because I thought it'd be cute. And this little jar is from the Dollar Tree as well. And it is so darling. It has the cute little silver top and I just filled it with mini chocolate chips. This um, little shaker is also from the Dollar Tree, filled with red sugar sprinkles, and the other one is filled with cinnamon. These little plastic shakers are so cute. This is a little lock jar that I got from Ross for like $2.99, and I really like it because it locks. No kids. <laughs> And um, I just tied a gold little ribbon around it, and these little gift tags came from the Target dollar spot, and I just wrote cocoa on it in the silver marker. This cute little guy came from Walmart. He was only like $1.97. I just hot glued him on top of that. And then you can fill it with like powdered cocoa, or I just like the package because then, you know, I don't have to measure it. <laughs> This is the salted caramel cocoa. I'm so excited to try. I got this at Target. This little glass jar I got at the Dollar Tree is just too cute for me. <laughs> it's so cute, and it was the perfect size for these straws. I got um, these paper straws at the Dollar Tree. And then I found these swizzle sticks at Walmart for $1.24 because the paper, you know, the paper... Um, straws don't really hold up with the hot chocolate if you're trying to stir the hot chocolate. So I definitely suggest the swizzle sticks instead. <laughs> this is from the Dollar Tree. It is a cute little um, Christmassy RV mug. So cute. And I got all of my coffee mugs from the Dollar Tree. Joy, Believe... 
and I love the gold. And of course, my favorite mug is I Love Santa. I love that one. it was that simple and it was a lot of fun to put together this was my first year putting a cocoa bar together and I had a lot of fun doing it um, thank you so much for watching and you better hit that subscribe button because this crazy family is gonna do some pretty awesome stuff this vlogmas we're gonna try and put up a video every single day up until Christmas we're going to Disney World we're going to Sea World we're going to Universal we've got tons of things planned so make sure you subscribe so you can come along with us. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.